The 22nd Amendment to the United States Constitution limits the number of times a person can be elected to the office of President of the United States to two terms and sets additional eligibility conditions for presidents who succeed to the unexpired terms of their predecessors one. It was passed by Congress in 1947 and ratified by the states in 1951. The amendment was one of 273 recommendations to the U.S. Congress by the Hoover Commission, created by President Harry S. Truman, to reorganize and reform the federal government under the 22nd Amendment. Someone who fills an unexpired presidential term lasting more than two years is also prohibited from being elected president more than once one. This means that if a vice president or another individual takes over the role of president for more than two years of a term, they are only eligible to be elected as president for one additional term. The first president to be affected by the 22nd Amendment was Dwight D. Eisenhower, who served two terms from 1953 to 1961. The amendment was passed by Congress in 1947 and ratified by the states in 1951 after Franklin D. Roosevelt had already served four terms as president.